Hello, my name is Gabriel Sanchez Gonzalez. I am the president of Tijuana Calidad de Vida. My name is Carmen Romo Diego, and I'm a co founder of Tijuana Calidad de Vida. Our focus is the urban and environmental areas. So, when we're talking about urban, it's pretty wide. So, you'll see that we have work uh, within promoting non motorized mobility, better waste management. We look forward for clean beaches and we also promote urban planning. The city gets created by its own. 50% of the city is irregular settlements and obviously this brings all these type of challenges and problems uh, for the environment and for the city. So we try to get together a group of friends because we don't like the quality of life of this city, so we should have a conversation. We started doing uh, round tables and we invited uh, the community, and that's how we started meeting people. We try to partner with nonprofits and also with the academic sector and the private sector to come up with uh, solutions. Um, and it can be something that it's very small, such as a cleanup on the beach, or it can be something uh, on a bigger scale where you can actually look for better policies and better um, compliance. We do have laws that cover uh, how the environment should be kept, but obviously we have a big issue on how this becomes in compliance. This lack of regulation, it is an issue because then at the end we're going to have water that it's contaminated, air that it's contaminated, and our soil that it's contaminated. We are part of the Comité de Playas Limpias. It's an official um, council that sits there, the three levels of government, and it also brings the community within. So we've been participating on this um, official council since 2011, so we try to talk with the government, to try to come up with solutions, but then um, we also try to inform our community on our right to have a clean environment. We strongly believe that urbanism can be also bottom to top. Usually we see our cities made top to bottom. We think any change that we can do for the city and the quality of life should be from the people that live there. There's different ways to approach the pro problem and so we try to make a balance between understanding the challenges that the government has, um, talking about financing all this infrastructure and make it work, but then we also are trying to learn more and use the, the tools that law gives us. And this engagement obviously has to be done with citizens that are knowledgeable, knowledgeable of what's going on on their surroundings and what their rights are. The quality of durable life is possible with uh, harmony with the environment. We totally believe that we can create a better environment, a better region for both Mexico and the United States. And we believe that we can work as a community and also work with the government, with the private sector, and with everyone that is involved within the city. We, what we want is just to have a better quality of life for everyone.